So Babaka has asked the question, what is the typical temperature difference between evaporator and plus and room for both minus and plus zero cold rooms? Um, generally, if it's a frozen room, um, humidity doesn't matter uh, as a sort of general statement. Um, if you are, let's say, uh, you know, for temperatures uh, freezing and below, um, generally a sort of 6K delta T is absolutely fine. And if we're talking about 6K delta T, then we are looking, you know, somewhere between, um, let's just read my book correctly, because I always have to check this, uh, 6K. So, yeah, you're looking around about 80%, 85% humidity. Um, there's no point dragging too much moisture out the air because then you're just going to put that on your evaporators and that's going to cost more money to defrost uh, and block up your evaporators quicker. So in a, uh, let's say, negative temperature room, humidity doesn't really count because the product's frozen already and humidity is not going to have a huge effect on the product, but it's going to have an effect on your evaporators. So, uh, so that's that. Then if we're talking above freezing, uh, so positive temperature room, it really depends on your product that you're storing in there. Um, and every product needs a different humidity. So, uh, you know, fruit and vegetables, meat, fish, uh, there's lots of information on the internet. Uh, and I've got lots of in information here in front of me on, on what you need for, for, for a Pacific product. Um, obviously, if you have, uh, and we'll, we'll take meat, for example, if you have a, a very high humidity, then the meat can get a little bit slimy. If you have a very low humidity, then you lose weight from the product because you're pulling moisture out of it, which for your customer is not good because generally he sells, you know, fruit, vegetables, all those sort of commodities by weight. So you don't want to to, uh, to pull moisture out the product and then reduce its weight. Uh, and also, if you remove moisture out the product, then you will reduce the quality of that product. Um, so I hope that answered that question, Babaka. Um, yeah.